Today's sales strategy, the cost of waiting. Hi everyone, I'm Steve Savant, host of the daily talk show, Let's Get Down to Business. And I'm Don Pratt, Senior Advisor to Ensmark. Tom, we're talking today about some almost like a concept, the cost of procrastination, and we're going to show the power of mathematics to demonstrate that there are some costs to waiting. Walk yeah. me through this. This is such a powerful idea. Obviously, one of the big reasons that clients should not wait to implement their cash value life insurance plans is because of health reasons. Mm. Obviously, we all know that if someone has a heart attack or has cancer uh, during the time they're procrastinating and not sure what to do, that changes everything. Mm -hmm. But there's another reason that they shouldn't procrastinate and we're gonna show the numbers here and I think it's gonna surprise you. Interesting, when you think about it, you say, well, we're only doing this for income. Is it gonna be that much difference delaying two years to fund this? Well, let's walk through this graph because this is really demonstrates my income, I'm using Index Universal Life on both columns here to demonstrate. I'm talking about buying it now and then procrastinating two years. Don, walk us through the numbers because to me, this is where so many advisors say, my client keeps stalling on me, but the cost of procrastination is really high, even for just two years. Yeah, it is. Um, if we move forward with the plan now, the policy premium is $23,717 a year, and it's a 20 pay. and can, on the opposite side, if we wait two years, the client says, you know, I'm just not sure, mm -hmm. why can't we do this in a couple years? The policy premium, again, max funded is $25,000 over 18 years because the client's two years older, they can put a little bit more uh, premium into the policy. What's interesting though, is that with the Move Now plan, the, the plan that they enforce today, they can take out $4 million in retirement income from the plan if they wait two years, they can only take out 3.4 million and the savings is only $18,000 in terms of with the original plan, they pay an $18,000 more in premium and if they wait two years, they pay an 18,000 less, mm -hmm. but they lose $600,000 of retirement income by waiting two years. If that isn't a good reason to mm -hmm. not procrastinate and move forward now, I've never heard it. And remember, if we wanted to just save a little money all the way out to age 90, 95, or even life expectancy at age 100, there's still some numbers here that are huge. Look at this cash value. I mean, we didn't even milk this contract from an income point of view as much as we could. We did maximize it. So we're still looking at 727 versus 600,000, and then the death benefit, 1.2 million. You're looking at another 100,000. So even though this is an income scenario, and we usually don't focus on death benefit, I just like the idea of that we're still, it shows pop the power of procrastination and why we need to do things today. Because remember, time is on an analog timeline. It waits for no man. And these two year delay over here costs us money that we could have had during retirement. Yeah, I just wanna show one thing here if I may. What we're showing here is, and again, this is at age 100. At age 100, the cumulative loan proceeds gain at age 100 by buying now is $643,000. Mm. And the additional premium you have to pay is only $17,000. The 20 pay versus the 18 pay, because we waited two years, the 20 pay was a higher premium. So mm -hmm. it paid about $17,000 more for a $643,000 increase in loan proceeds. Uh, at, again, we're looking at age 100. Mm -hmm. So what we were wondering was, you know, does this only work if you go out to age 100? What happens if you go out to life expectancy of age 85? Well, when we go out to age 85, procrastination is procrastination. <laughs> so it doesn't matter if we do this to age 100 or age 85. And this demonstrates Still the summary yep. shows that you're actually losing money. It's costing you to wait. Yeah, and again, same, this is exactly the same uh, analysis. And what we found was that if you go out to age 85, the cumulative loan proceeds gain at age 85 by buying now $320,000 more retirement income, and again, at a cost of only $17,000. And one of the things the Insmark system will, will also create is it will show you that if you took that $17,000 and tried to create that $300,000 of increase in retirement income, you would need to put it in an investment that earned 14.06%. Mm -hmm. So what we're seeing here is that the cost of waiting two years was really mm -hmm. expensive for the client in this case. So when we're thinking about the cost of procrastination, are we the procrastination nation? Maybe, but the cost is demonstrated so easily by using wealthy and wise, so you can show your client that there's really a cost 
or delaying and deferring. Today's sales idea is brought to you by Ash Brokerage, a practice enhancement company. And by Ensmark, the most widely used software when it comes to strategies and presentations using Cash Value Life Insurance.